Hey guys, what is going on? It's Dirty HD here, and today I've got a very special video regarding the VMP. After all the recent nerfing and buffing of all these different guns, the VMP, I am bringing you the best class setup for the VMP. Literally, no, I have not been sitting there doing every single combination of attachments and all that stuff with the VMP because there are 10 attachments for the VMP and if you really want to go there then there's a billion different combinations literally a billion different combinations of attachments that you can use and if I was gonna do that it would take me a couple years before I could bring out this video Personally, on screen you're going to see a gameplay in the background of me using this VMP and you're also going to see a gameplay, well not a gameplay, a little screenshot of my class setup as I go through it. So, first of all we start off with the VMP itself. I've got the uh, diamond camo on it just because I can, because I've got it. Um, I didn't use an optic sight, I used quick draw so I can aim down the sights fast because when you're using a submachine gun you want to be able to get in straight with that aim and you're just running and gunning, you're getting up close and personal and you just want to get that quick aim on them. Next I used the grip because the VMP recoil is kind of like, it's not that great but when you're shooting in a long distance um, gunfight, the VMP is not really ideal for it, but the grip will help um, to make it a little bit easier and maybe say instead of 1 in 10 without it, you'll get a kill. You might now in 3 in 10 get the kill. Next, I am using the stock so I can move faster whilst aiming down the sight. I personally think this... Um, Attachment is very OP, which is why I use it because it increases the accuracy and just, I don't know, it just creates a whole new feel for the gun. Now, I don't have any secondaries and I don't have a lethal or a tactical grenade, um, but I do have four perks. Now, I did use um, perk greed on the perk one uh, slots. And that is because I am using Afterburner so I can jump about and get, make the most of the movement system in Black Ops 3. Also, I did use Ghost because the gameplays that I kind of, or the game modes that I mostly use, are game modes where UAVs get put in quite often and I'm always moving around so I won't be detected by a UAV which is quite helpful when using a submachine gun. In perk 2 I use fast hands because it swaps weapons faster which I don't need but it aims faster after sprinting so obviously I'm going to be running about and I just want to get my gun up as quickly as possible and start shooting the guy as soon as I run into one. I use blast press so I can jump around the map, hop around the map and also you can do, um, I can't remember what that jump's called. The G slide, that's what it's called. You can use the G slide as of now, um, but you can only do it off of objects. I will do a tutorial on how to do it um, in the future, so stay tuned for that. But other than that, that is my whole class setup, except for I do use the Reaper or the Scythe, um, if you want to call it that, in, as well as my specialist. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I sure did enjoy bringing it to you. Uh, if you did, please do leave that thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Peace. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Dirty HD here. And today I have a new Master Prestige glitch for you. What you want to do is you want to head into your settings and you want to turn your network off. And it should come up with that error in the top left hand corner. Then after that, it should do this loading process um, when you do try to start the game.